YouTube, Flatbrook Air Gunner family, Facebook family, welcome, our ranch air gun fund, I got a pretty special verse today, the most beautiful day God's made, and today I'm going to read you Psalms 23. But first, let's go into a prayer. Father, in heaven, Lord Jesus Christ, our Savior, we come to you now and we lift up this day. We lift up to you all of our Aragon brothers and sisters, our brothers and sisters in Christ. We ask you to watch over us and shine upon us. We ask you to help us shoot straight, to remember our safety glasses, and most of all, to point and have fun. In Jesus Christ's holy name, I pray this. Amen. This is a psalm of David. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He guides me through the path of righteousness in his name's sake. Yea, I'll walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod, your staff, to guide me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil, my cup overflows. And surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. For those of you who aren't familiar with this verse, I'm going to do a little bit of breakdown for you. Now this was uh, Psalms 1 through 6. Psalms 23, 1 through 6. Psalms 1, breakdown is this. The finger of the shepherd picks the Lord as guide, protector, and constant companion. Verse 2. Quiet waters, inlets, or ponds where rest and refreshment could be found. Twenty-three, three restores through the provision of food and water. God's leading is always in path, which is right in His eyes, which will honor His name. 24 and 23 4. The shepherd protects his sheep with his rod or his club, used to fight off wild bees, and he guides strange sheep with his staff or crook. 23 5. As a gracious host, God provides all that we need, anointed, a courtesy shown guest. At a banquet. 22 6. David sees himself not, mer not merely as a guest for a day, but a recipient of God's covenant, loving kindness, forever in the house of the Lord, is his place where God is. Lord Jesus, I hope and pray that through this, ears were open, eyes could see what was bring, being brought out today. In Jesus Christ, holy name, we pray this. Amen. Thank you very much. God bless you. 
and have a great day.